I think the phone today is probably the most ubiquitous object that we engage with. So a very interesting, you know, piece of our everyday life to alter. In a lot of my work, I think very heavily about both what the sculpture looks like, but also what it's made out of. So the use of crystal volcanic ash makes us think about geological time, right? The object has this kind of truth in it. And I started working with patinaed bronze a couple of years ago, which makes us think of history. You know, I'm always interested in bringing my work into arenas that are not a typical art world scenario. And Xiaomi reached out with this new phone that they were developing and had some pretty amazing capabilities for creating texture. It seemed like an interesting project to bring this type of erosion into something that people would engage with daily. I took the opportunity to create a really special, almost sculptural box that does have a different weight to it and feels almost like what you would imagine a sculpture, you know, would be. I think that even once you remove the phone from the box, you might keep the box itself as an art object. So it's sort of thinking about the purpose of that is not just its functionality, it's also um, a sculptural proposition. Xiaomi is inherently interested in the future. They're thinking about what's happening in five years or 10 years. So I'm quite sure that in 20 years, there will be people who have this phone that don't use it as a phone anymore, and it just becomes a sculptural object that is kind of linked to a, a particular moment in time. And in that way, its use is carried beyond the functionality of it. It becomes a sculpture. Xiaomi.